James Naismith James Naismith was born in Almonte, Ontario in Canada on November 6, 1861. While he was still a child, both of his parents died from typhoid fever. James went to live with his uncle Peter where he helped work on the farm. Young James enjoyed athletics and playing games. One of his favorite games was called Duck on a Rock. In this game, a smaller rock was placed on top of a big rock. Then the players would try to knock the duck off the rock by throwing a small stone. This game would later be part of the inspiration behind his invention of basketball. In 1883, Naismith enrolled at the McGill University in Montreal. He was a good athlete and participated in many sports including football, lacrosse, gymnastics and rugby. After graduating with a degree in physical education, he went to work as a PE teacher at McGill. He later left Montreal and moved to Springfield, Massachusetts, where he went to work for YMCA. During the winter of 1891, Naismith was put in charge of a class of rowdy boys. He needed to come up with an indoor sport that would keep them active and help burn off some energy. He considered sports like football, baseball and knuckles, but they were either too rough or couldn't be played indoors. Naismith eventually came up with the game of basketball. His idea was to have a basket placed high on the wall. Players would have to throw a soccer ball into the basket to score points. To keep injuries to a minimum, he said they couldn't run with the ball. In order to move the ball closer to the basket, they would have to pass it. He called the game basketball. Naismith wrote down 13 basic rules of the game. Included were rules such as a player cannot run with the ball, no shouldering, holding, striking, pushing or tripping, and the time shall be two 15-minute halves. He posted the 13 rules on the bulletin board in the gym before class so the boys could read them and understand how to play. It didn't take long for basketball to become one of the boys' favorite sports. Other classes at the Springfield YMCA began to play the game and in 1893 the YMCA introduced the game throughout the country. Naismith went on to become the first basketball coach at the University of Kansas. At first, most of his games were played against YMCA teams and nearby colleges. His overall record at Kansas was 55 to 60. In his later life, Naismith saw basketball grow to become one of the world's most popular sports. Basketball became an official sport of the Olympics in 1936 Summer Olympic Games. Naismith was able to hand out the Olympic medals to the winning teams. He also helped to form the National Association of the Intercollegiate Basketball in 1937. James Naismith was 78 years old when he suffered a brain hemorrhage and died on 28th of November 1939. The Naismith Memorial Basketball Hall of Fame was named in his honor in 1959. Each year, the best college basketball players and coaches are honored with the Naismith Awards.